I want you to move to France with me. You know what? I just don't understand how you can be this unreasonable. <sighs> unreasonable? You know, Rose, when you left for six months to do your job, I was there to support you. Fully. That entire damn time. And you were gone for an entire six months. And now you're asking to permanently live there. <sighs> I just... I can't. Okay. Not right now. Adam, all I'm asking is for you to consider. Can you do that for me? Please. How is it that hard to just consider? You know what, Rose? I'm just gonna go to bed. I'll see you tomorrow. Adam. I, uh, don't know what to do. What would you do in this situation, if you were me? I don't know, Rose. It is a hard decision. I mean, for me it's different, though. I don't have a boyfriend that I spent four years with. <laughs> I date lots of guys instead. Particularly weird ones. So, I guess for me it wouldn't be as hard. And well, judging by what you're telling me, it doesn't sound like he's very excited to go. I know he's not. He's considering it. Because I asked him to. I don't... I don't know what to do. I could just say no and not take the job and uh, spend my life living here in New York with you guys and uh, just stick to my agency here. Or I could go to France with my boyfriend and live in Paris. <sighs> it would be selfish of me to just bring him along when he doesn't want to. I don't want to be selfish. And I feel selfish already as it is. I want to do what he wants to do. You know? We're a partnership, that's what it is. But... I also want to do what I want to do. In this job, it's... It's a fantastic offer, Sophia. It's a hard decision, Rose. And I can't help you make it. But just know that whatever you guys choose, I support it. Because I'm your friend. It's just... I'd really miss you. <laughs> I'd miss you too. All of you. Yeah. That's the only downside. <laughs> but it's your decision, Rose. You and Adam's decision. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Rose. Hey. They, uh, need to know by Friday. Yeah. Okay. You already know, don't you? Rose, I... I've thought about it a lot. 
I'm trying to think of ways why moving to France would be great. And there's only one reason. You. You're the only reason I would move. There's no... There's no other reason for me to move to France, Rose. I would only go for you. Maybe you could get a job there that you really like. Maybe I could ask the agency if you want to be a model with me. I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to be a model, Rose. That's your thing. I... I don't want you to go just because of me. I mean, I want you to go, but I want you to go because you want to as well. And I know you don't want to. Rose, I'm sorry, I don't. It's uh, we just moved in together, Rose. Not even three months ago. And it's been great having you here. Really great. I know, Adam. I know. And uh, I didn't know I was going to get a phone call, okay? I had no idea. Yeah, so let's go back to the way things were. Before you got the call. Us. Just us. Living together. In New York. <sighs> Doesn't that sound... good? Good enough? You have a job here. You're already a model. I know, Adam, I know. And I've thought about staying here. I have. I mean... This has been a hard decision on me too, okay? I want... this job. I really do. And you know what? There's no hiding that. I've made that pretty clear already. So, what you're saying is, you're gonna go anyway, right? I don't, I don't know, Adam. Maybe, I don't... <sighs> so, what, I live here in New York and I have a girlfriend in France. Adam, you know what? My career, you know. I love it. It's my favorite thing. It's the best job I've ever had. And this offer, it's... It's... Fantastic. Great. I've got it. Adam, I'm sorry. I... I want to live with you. I want you to live with me too! That's why we should move together. I'm including you in this. Rose, my friends are here. Jason, Emma, Sophia. My apartment is here. My life is here. But you're my life. You've been a part of my life for a very long time. I can't imagine anything else. So. You're staying, right? Yes, I... I want to stay here. But with you. Adam, I... I don't... I don't know, I... You asked me to consider moving with you. But my answer is no. Why can't you just consider not taking the job. Why is it so damn important over everything else? Again, with the career thing. It's always first. Because it makes me happy, Adam. Just like you living here does. It makes me happy, my career. I guess it's always been on the top of my list. Along with you. You've always been first, Adam. But I love my job. And I love this offer. And... 
I think I'm gonna take it. Rose, you have to consider staying. I mean... I've already considered, Adam. I've thought about being here with you. But it just... I choose France. You're 100% sure on this? Yes. Yes, I am. I want to do this. For me. And I wanted you to come with me. But I have to respect your decision. Just like you have to respect mine. Damn it, Rose. Adam, I'm sorry. What does this mean for us, then? How's that going to work? Rose. How? I don't know. Maybe I could fly back and forth every few weeks or something. Or you could do that. We both could. To see each other. And, and... That won't work. It just... It won't work. We can't do that the rest of our lives, Rose. We just, we can't. We can't. It just... It won't work. You know, I saw us getting married in the future. Or, or having kids later down the road. But I think all that is just out the window now because I'm gonna have a long distance girlfriend again. Except this time it's permanent. I wanted all those things too, Adam. Okay? You don't have to act like the victim here. How do you think it's going to work, huh? Well? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to get used to not seeing you every day. And kissing you or laying next to you and falling asleep on your lap or hugging you. I'm gonna wanna hug you every damn day when I'm in France, Adam. For as long as I can and I'm gonna wanna call you all the time and I can't, I can't be like that. You won't be there. You, you'll be miles away in another country and I'll always be wondering what you're doing and how you're feeling. I'm sorry, Adam. Rose. We can make it work. We can, Rose. It doesn't have to be like this. We could do the long distance thing again. Maybe just like we did when you were gone for six months. I can call you, and you can call me, and we can talk for hours. It's... It can be like that. We can still be together. Long distance relationships, they do work. They can work. You just... You have to try, Rose. No, Adam. It won't work. Six months is one thing, but the rest of our lives, that's another. Soon, we'll grow apart. We'll stop talking to each other as much. Rose, don't. Mm -hmm. We won't think of each other as much. Soon, after a while, you will be the last thing on my mind. Rose, stop. It won't work, and you know it. Maybe it will at first, but it will stop working. Damn it. Why? 
do you always have to be right? <laughs> I don't know. What do we do? Is this it? Is it over? <laughs> yes, Adam. This is it. I'm breaking up with you. <laughs> Come here. Adam. Come here. We have to do this. You and I, we want different things. Rose, I can't. I can't do it. You're a part of me. I can't lose you. But you have to. Adam. You know you have to. I don't... I... Don't go. Please don't go. I'm sorry. I'm letting you go. Okay? Rose, no. We can still be together, Rose. You know that's not true. I love you, and I always will, but we have to stop doing this, for the both of us. I love you, always. I love you too. Always. You ready to go? Yeah, it's just... a room. It's... empty now. Yeah, it is. Thanks, Adam, for... driving me to the airport. Yeah, of course. I hope your new job is really great. Yeah. Me too.
I hope that. Uh, everything is good for you here. Yeah. Me too. I love you. Rose. I love you and... Now... I'm letting you go. I love you too. Goodbye, Adam. Okay, this time, this time for sure. Yeah. Thank you.